As schools around Texas extend spring break, some parents are looking for ways to keep their children learning at home. Here's KXAN's Wes Rappaport with how some families are getting creative. Just a bunch of different items to keep them occupied. The sign out front of Teacher Heaven in Austin says it's not just for teachers. Certainly the case this week as parents hit the school supply shelves. We don't want it to stop because even during summer we keep them occupied, whether if it's reading, actually they read every day. So we just want to keep that learning going so they don't forget the things that they have learned so far this year. Even during spring break, Amy Morrison is looking for ways to make sure her three kids keep learning at home, with many schools across the state canceling classes amid coronavirus concerns. We really didn't know how we were going to adapt until the phone started ringing and we got an uptick in calls from parents. Teacher Heaven is keeping its two locations in Austin and Houston open for business, selling science kits for geology, chemistry and animals, and workbooks for reading, writing and math. We have marked all of our workbooks and study books down 20%, so if that helps and makes those, more, those little study materials more attainable, we'd love to help. For now, the Morrisons haven't made a long-term plan. They're taking it a few weeks at a time and hoping the schools will soon provide some help at home. For our younger two, second and fifth grade, they did send home stuff on last Friday, some materials that to use if the break would have been extended. Our seventh grader did not, but she has a school issued laptop. So I'm assuming material will be sent through Google Classroom at some point in the next week. A rep from the Texas Education Agency tells me the state is working on issuing additional guidance for families, but also adds that many school districts are planning through how to pursue distance learning or other online opportunities. In Austin, I'm Wes Rappaport, back to you. And some of the parents we spoke with say they plan to work in some outside time for their children as well as they keep looking for ways to practice social distancing. Northwestern University has tips to help you fight loneliness and depression in this time of social distancing for your entire family. Set some activities and play times. You could use board games, you could read, watch movies, uh, but schedule and structure that time. It is good for children and your own sense of uh, okay. time schedules. If you do work from home, they recommend web conferencing when possible. Uh, even try some face-to-face -face virtual interaction. Also, check in on friends and neighbors. That is more than just helping them. Just the act of helping others can boost your own mood and mental health.